Welcome back everyone. This is episode four, exercise four of my PSM active stretch series. In this episode, we're hitting the mat and we're gonna do, I think this one, or maybe the next episode might be my favorite, but this is called PSM roll and wrap. To me, this really feels like a wonderful decompression of the spine. So for the strap configuration, whenever I do Pilates suspension method workouts, I always tell my client that, because I do a lot of FaceTime and Zoom workouts, is that when the straps are at their longest length, if you push on the foot cradles, the foot cradles should just be a couple inches from the ground. So why don't you go ahead and set that up and then we'll do the PSM roll and wrap. Just like always, I'm gonna take it quite slow at first and then I'll pick up the pace um, as I teach along. Okay, so it's seated nice and tall, neutral spine, hands are in the foot cradles. My um, knees are, or my shins are about under the anchor point, depending on how you're anchored, depends on kind of where that is at. If you have a hard time sitting up tall, you can bend the legs a little bit. From here, you're gonna start to roll it down and bending the legs. Once you hit the lumbar spine, lower the head, bring the legs to tabletop. Then you're gonna wrap the legs out, in, and then out into your open leg diamond position. Then articulate tail to upper mid back. This is where I just love this. I like to stay up here for about three to five breath patterns. And I like to imagine that there's a little bit increased space between each vertebrae. And that's that decompression of the spine feeling. Also like to think about opening up through the hips as well. Kind of lean thinning out through that psoas. Once you're done up here with a couple of breath patterns, softening the chest away from the chin as you articulate down. Once you hit your lumbar spine, carefully unravel the legs to tabletop and come into a thoracic flexion. Start to lower the toes on the mat as you roll up and stretch forward. Nice long stretch. Articulate tail to head and return home. This time I'm gonna take it through a little more fluid. Roll it down, start to bend the legs, hit the lumbar spine, head down, tabletop. Wrap out, in, out, find that open leg diamond. Articulate up, tail to upper mid back. Now, like I said in that first repetition, I like to hold it up here. My clients, they love doing hip thrusts. Hinge the hips down and up. So maybe three to five breaths or three to five hip lifts or hip thrusts. And then roll it down one vertebrae at a time. Hit the lumbar spine. Tabletop, thoracic flexion. Stretch it long. Articulate tail to head. And let's do one more. Roll it down. Hit that lumbar spine. Tabletop. Head down, wrap out, in, out to this open leg diamond position. Roll it up, tail to upper mid back. Let's hold it here for one full breath pattern. Inhale through the nose, exhale through pursed lips. Imagine that increased space between each vertebrae and then soften the chest away from the chin. Unravel the legs to tabletop. Articulate up and stretch. Roll it all the way back home. So this exercise, actually I teach in my Pilates Suspension Method Foundation course. You can definitely go on my website, pilates949.com and check out all my different Pilates Suspension Method course. Each course, you're gonna learn over 80 exercises. Thanks for joining me and have fun with the PSM Rolling Wrap.